So I got me this garbage bag. We got to clean out the car while I am at least right now. Gabby's inside making breakfast. And we're going to be leaving tomorrow, which I believe is when this video will be out. So you'll be watching this as we're on the road. We're on to the next place again. <laughs> so God's doing things. He's speaking to us as always. And we're just trying to be obedient and follow him because that's our life. Our life is for him. And uh, we're just excited for whatever God has next. My hair is a mess. I just woke up, but I'm going to start cleaning. So let's get to it. I just ran inside. I had to get my coffee. It's so weird. As a husband now, I notice that I drink more coffee. And I never had this crazy thing for coffee. I guess when you get married, the... The guy just drinks coffee, or that's just a me thing. All right, so I just came in, my beautiful wife just made me some breakfast. My favorite, biscuits and gravy. <laughs> Thanks, Amen. babe. You're welcome. Real contentment arises from a spirit of thankfulness. It is great. Are you okay? It's just for the vlog. Are you on For a spirit of thankfulness. It is a courageous choice to walk by faith and thank God for what you have and for what you don't have. Okay, so last one, it says verbally demonstrate three different ways to say I'm sorry. So like three ways of saying I'm sorry. So since it's like a genuine one, because typically it's, oh, hey, I'm sorry. And then it's, that's it. Bye. But based on what we were reading now, it'd be like, hey, I'm sorry that I did such and such. Do you forgive me? Is there anything that I can do? <laughs> can I wash your feet? Aw. And then obviously repent explain what happened which yeah. should be first probably well it goes ex express regret like oh i'm sorry explain what happened i did this and i'm just in a bad mood but i shouldn't have taken it out on you i'm gonna turn away from this is there anything i can do will you forgive me gabby why are you a hoarder i don't know i don't even have that many things i'm just kidding anyways we're getting stuff done and we're just moving all the stuff out there for now and then we get it to get to the car so it's going pretty fast, I would say. Gabby's a good organizer. I put all my clothes way up there. And then I have like one bag with clothes in it. So these go in last. So we're putting all our suitcases in. Gabby's is the heaviest. Oh. Yeah. She's in there. <laughs> all my clothes, y'all, that I own are in there. <laughs> yeah, we don't own a lot of things anymore, so. We, it, once again, we're leaving stuff behind. Actually, everything I own is in there, and then that's all our wedding stuff in that yeah. little thing. Oh, wait, my hair's kind of messy. It's okay. Look at that. So this is like, I would say 80% of our stuff. Yeah. So we, we just have a little bit in. more. We put down the seats to make more space. So it's actually working out. The wife and I are at the store. I'm getting cheese puffs. Gabby, what are you getting? You're willing to get dill pickle over buffalo ranch yeah. Doritos. I got some salted baseball peanuts. You already know. Gabby's about to trade in her chips for bananas. You almost made me fall. But I only <laughs> want four bananas. So I don't want them to get away. So hey everyone, so today is the next day and we're gonna be heading out today. We're leaving New York. I'm gonna go downstairs, make some coffee. Gabby's making breakfast. And then we got some cleaning to do, but it shouldn't take too long. All right, so we're back to loading the car with more stuff. You excited today, Gabby? I definitely feel more excited. For the, for the first day in like a week, I actually feel rested. Amen. And I didn't sleep like a crazy amount. I don't even know, maybe six and a half hours. And it's really nice out today, y'all. So it's exciting. The roads are good. Yeah, it's you good. can literally put your phone back like right there. All right. All right, everyone, so me and my wife are in the car. We're headed to the next place. We have a lot of joy right now, even though we're going in faith, because it's just, it's just knowing that God has something now yes. and believing that we're gonna have roots in North Carolina is exciting. It is exciting. <laughs> so. Show them the packed car. Yeah, oh yeah, very, very packed, but we can still see out of it. Y'all, it's actually so. a miracle because last time we were driving when we packed this car, I couldn't see out of my back window. And, I, and it literally, when I, was, I sat here earlier to check and I still couldn't see, but now all of a sudden I can see out of my back window.
Babe, where are we eating? Where do you think? Cracker Barrel. Let's I've been do it. here since right before we got married. Oh yeah, this was, we ate here the day before we got married. Yeah. So we're getting some driving in. It's nighttime mm -hmm. right now. And uh, we're headed to a hotel basically because it's a 10 hour drive, but we're not gonna drive all the way. 10 and so, half hours without stops. Yeah. And we've made it how many hours? Actually, we've been on the road for almost 12 and a half hours. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah, so. But I'm not even tired, it's just practical. I got a prime. All right, so we're at our hotel for the night, Holiday Inn Express. Gabby picked out a nice spot for us to sleep tonight. Then we're gonna wake up in the morning, eat some breakfast, and we only have like two and two and a half hours, I think. Oh wow, a little less than two hours. Hey everyone, so we just woke up. It was a good night's sleep actually. Everywhere me and Gabby sleep, I usually wake up at least once or twice in the middle of the night, but I literally slept the entire night. It was crazy. So, but my back was hurting. I don't know if it's bad or the back's just been bothering me. So, y'all could pray for it if you like. Don't tell breakfast be in different rate, Gabby. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we got a nice view out here. Fence. Officially in North Carolina, so you Jump hear my guy, he's talking to me. Anyways, we're going to be arriving at our spot, and we just, again, believe we're going to be rooted in North Carolina. We're going to have a more in-depth video coming soon, but for now, this is what you get, so. Enjoy. 